how to reset your life when you are feeling lost. Dear friends, good day to everyone. On this long journey of- When I was a kid, I feel like you heard the thing, you heard the term, don't cry. You don't need to cry. You can make videos like this with the fantasy talking avatar with the Alibaba's latest model and by the end of the video I'll teach you how you can use it on your cloud if you have a low end PC, if you have a higher end PC, how you can run these on locally with comfy UI and by the end of the video you'll know everything about this latest model and I'll show you some of the examples I have personally generated and a lot of videos about talking avatar from this model so this video is gonna be very interesting. I'm Adit and you're watching Skill Curve. Okay now it's time to see how fantasy talking avatar are good and I'll compare them. So let's talk about some solo prompt first. So first image of we have of this cartoon kid sitting in with hills and greenery. You can see the sky looking pretty good fun. You can see the video, it's three second video. With fantasy talking, avatars don't just talk, they act. So you can see he's saying fantasy talking avatar, they don't just talk, they act. You can see they are really acting. Look at this guy, the guy is moving, the hands movement of this guy is pretty fun. However, this is cartoon, but the realism they promoted with this fantasy talking avatar is pretty interesting we need to talk about. Um, let's talk about another image of this cat, which is also very interesting with this comes to facial expression. We're turning up the quality of your characters. So this cat says we are turning up to the quality of your character and just look at the expression this cat has. The facial hair of the cat is moving slightly with proper physics, makes it perfectly fine, okay? Another, another, another image we have of this robot speaking. System online. Diagnostics complete. You seem And you can high. see the box it is holding and the hand movement of this robot is perfect the lip movement is also perfectly syncing so what we can say is it's the model doing perfectly fine well we will not just stop here we will see more examples to get more clarity about this model and we'll also tell you how you can install it in the later part of the video you want a real piece of advice instead of hating your job Try loving so the another fact image of this, we have this green egg and I guess this is some character from Toy Story if I'm right and you can see again the facial expression and the eyes movement is absolutely good. The eyebrows and the way it is showing in a different direction, the hand movement is absolutely good. I'm really impressed by a model which claims about fantasy talking. Infinite possibilities. But first of all, you need inspiration. Okay, another sketch image of we have this beautiful lady where this is speaking something and you can see the movement of their lips, the wrinkles, the facial muscles, they're moving right now is absolutely fine. I have never experienced the AI will do this much good. Ah, welcome, welcome. You're just in time. I made a fresh batch of my world face. And you can see a welcome, welcome, you're just in time. You can see the facial expression. I'm not lying, but it's looking almost like a movie. If the model get more realistic, you can expect a movie getting shooter from that. I mean, look at the facial expression and the lines on the forehead, by the way. However, one thing I've noticed is the background looking is pretty unrealistic, but most of the things are good. Well, it depends on what kind of image you provide too. It's time to turn up the quality of your characters. Another image of this lady in the Times Square, I guess, is speaking and look at the and look at the physics of her hair, by the way. It's moving perfectly fine with the flow of air. And I, I genuinely admit that Fat Fantasy Talking did a really good work when it comes to making them expressively good. Okay, now it's time to compare them with uh, their contemporary models. So we have Omnihuman and we have Fantasy Talking and we have this reference image and just see the video. Oh, I know what to do. <laughs> I can slide and die. So you can see this is saying, oh, I know what to do. I can slide and you can see the Omnihuman one and Fantasy Talking. They both have a very different kind of facial expression. Omnihuman is going good, but look at the fantasy talking. The way it's moving his hand and the brighter look of the face and come a kind of sunlight effect is also coming with the fantasy eye, makes it perfectly well. And look at the way the character is closing its eyes, which 
I feel it's lagging in the Omni Human. Okay, we will not stop only here. We have another reference image and see this 8 second long video and decide yourself. Oh, don't scare me like that. <laughs> My birthday party's in 10 days and everyone in the past is gonna be there. You can see the fantasy talking avatar is just doing much better and much smoother transition than the omni human one and we just compare it with the high motion intensity and low motion intensity now you can realize how cool this fantasy talking thing is and i'm really impressed by the way he belongs here on the island with us not in some home put out to pasture by the archdiocese you can see this original video of this woman and you can see how clear fantasy talking making it like it's making much better video than omni human and i'm really impressed by this okay let's talk about another video we have is the guy as a tourist it's talking speaking something and you can compare the omni human one and fantasy talking omni human one character is moving the head so fast which makes it very unnatural in a quiet village where the sky brushes the fields in hues of gold young mia discovered a map leading to forgotten treasures. On the right side, the fantasy talking one is doing absolutely well and I'm really impressed by the fantasy talking motions. Okay, another scary video we have of this doll speaking and just look at this. You look at me and see only steel, don't you? Armor, blade, unyielding resolve. What we can see is that this doll is speaking is perfectly fine in the fantasy talking, the way moving its hand, while on the omni one, it's just moving his head. And that may, and the Omni one is just moving her head and the fantasy talking one, she is like, you know, explaining things and with the proper physics movement, the facial expression, uh, the veins on the neck is absolutely fire. Okay, another cartoonish video we have this guy selling ice cream and here fantasy talking and Omni human both are doing very, very well actually. Both have same kind of video generation. So we can't compare here. Ah, welcome, welcome. You're just in time. I made a fresh batch of my world. Okay, another last but not the least, we have this cartoonish Pixar type of cartoon. And look at their comparison. Now that we've created a character, added a script, and chosen the perfect voice, it's time I to bring fantasy talking one is winning here because look at the way it's stating and the movement of the hand between them. Fantasy one thing we have noticed that fantasy talking not just only focuses on lip sync, on facial expression, it also focuses on the surrounding, which makes it perfectly well. Okay, since we have already seen this model, let's talk about how the behind the scene this works. Okay, so you get better know. So fantasy talking is built upon VAN 2.1 video diffusion transfer model to generate highly realistic and visually coherent talking portraits, leveraging a dual stage audio visual alignment training process and our methods effectively captures the relationship between the audio signals and lip movement. So facial expression as well as body motion to enhance the identity consistency within the generated video. So now you have an idea of it works on VAN 2.1 video diffusion model and that's why it is so so realistic when it comes to video generation out of the image. So let's talk about what we're gonna do. First, we will firstly install it on our local uh, machine. You have to clone the GitHub repository. All the link is in the description. You will need the 14 billion parameter image to video model which you with you on 2.0 serving as the core model for Alibaba's multimedia AI tool. While we'll focus on Alibaba's offering, the pattern applies a base model and a branch of add-on models. What you need to do is, model management now involves a separate files you can run locally in Comfy UI. If you prefer, if you want to prefer um, this fantasy talking avatar, you can go to the Hugging Face Space demo, which accepts image and audio, just upload our image and audio. But note this model do not animate existing video frame by frame. Instead, you supply an image and it will generate a video out of it by the audio you provide. So you can adjust parameters for movements and intensity. And you can have a calmer presentation. Now, if you have a low VRAM, which you don't have on a high end PC, so you can go to the hugging phase of this model. You can see the link in the description. It's very simple. Just upload your audio and image and that's it. If you have a low VRAM, otherwise you can download a fantasy talking FP 16 tensor file, which is 1.6 GB and the link in the description and then prepare comfy UI. Now what you need to do is open comfy UI and you can load the provided workflow. So I have already provided the workflow in the description. Just download it. It's a basic JSON file. And now it's built on 1x video wrapper uploaded on one 
It's uploaded for v2.1 and includes a custom fantasy talker node. Once loaded, the FP16 model automatically downloads your comfy y diffusion model folder along with the Facebook's wave to wec audio model. Manually downloading it is optional. If you're curious, the nodes, logs, shows, file path, the workflow drives from comfy UI simple examples. The modification to suit my preferences and you'll need 1.2.1 ms2 video model i use 480p for smoother performance if you want some high-end performance you can go for 720p and you want 2.1 vae and umt xxl text encoder and cliff vision edge encoder for processing the input adjust with height and frame count in resize image v2 and high resolution increase vram uses sampling setting remains straightforward when I refer to FT, it's mean fantasy talking, so that's custom embedded connecting to the audio to the avatar model, maintaining consistent lift framework counts and FPS setting, which is 23 by default, experimenting with FPS and CFG scale, fine tunes the lip sync and body movements. The workflow duplicates setting across the one video sampler and fantasy talking sampler. I found a 30 step sufficient, though you can increase it and find the details. You can specify your path for your source of audio, video, and image for avatar you can then review your sample output fantasy talk fantasy talking outperforms earlier image to video avatar by re-rendering the full frame each time the rather than bounding box clips edits for partial animation so now you can see fantasy talking in comfy y leverages alibaba c1 2.0 foundation plus custom fp16 and wave to wake model and create a lifelike talking avatar from the static image and audio file if you like this video just simply click on like button share it and for more such cutting edge tutorial latest technologies videos every day just subscribe the channel